Is it just me? Or does that remind you of chicken dumplings? Good morning, guys. So I was getting ready to edit the video, the next video for you guys talking about the windows. So what we did was we, this, um, the past couple days, we took out um, all the windows that we're going to be keeping, which out of 21 regular windows, we're keeping, let's see, we're getting rid of six. So whatever's left from that, that's what we're keeping. So um, I think it's 15. So anyway, we took out those windows. We cleaned them. We resealed them with butyl tape and on the inside. And then we caulked the outside. Um, so we didn't clean the windows. The windows are still going to need like the glass itself because we had to use, um, acetone and, and John even used some gooby gone stuff. Um, so we're going to still clean all of that. But, but anyway, so I am just telling you guys what this footage is about. So follow along as we do the windows and as soon as we get the deletes that we ordered, we will do a video on those as well. So, hope you enjoy. So, that right there is the first window out. My guy got the window out. Your old man. Woo, my old man. <laughs> oh, is there a lot to clean around it? Well, it's, I mean, that right there, I think, is where they usually leak. Yeah, down right in the there, mm -hmm. down in that crease right there, uh -huh. that steel crease. Yeah. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking if you keep it, and excuse my voice because I've been laryngitis sick this week. <laughs> but if you keep these windows sealed, if you stop the, the leak, I think, I think, and then you keep it sealed on the outside, especially if you're going to be living in the bus or camping in it regular. I think I figured out a way. I get a flat, uh, flathead screwdriver, take the screws out of the sides here, stick the screwdriver down in the top and twist it and pull. Okay. Pull as you twist. I seen a guy having a hard time with this, so I figured I'd share it. Just twist and pull, twist okay. and pull the top. And when you get it like this, kind of. Got it out. Good job. Look at that. We got, that makes me want to take them all out and clean them, dog. <laughs> <clears throat> How much money you got? Money? I ain't got no money. <laughs> I got time right now. For at this moment. <laughs> well, I'm the one supposed to have the time. Because mm -hmm. if you got the money, honey, <laughs> I got the time. <laughs> Can't sing, bless his heart. <laughs> Might not sing with a voice. Taking out our first it's emergency well, let me show you how window. The way I did it was, um, since we got these two out, um, you gotta be careful with the glass cause it will break. So what you do, 
that that one's probably yes. that one's not that one don't seem sealed it's got yet. a cord in it to the uh, emergency how many cords is well, it that one don't seal oh don't look like pull it up from take take it like it this a cord oh it does have a cord in it oh. no that ain't gonna help that ain't gonna matter yeah because I think they'll... I hadn't took a... Emer I hadn't took an emergency one down. I'm careful. It's sealed at the bottom. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, okay. Well, that's a bit dumb. Yeah, that it's sealed, sealed at the bottom, but not at the top? Huh. Yeah. Well, I must not need it at the top. Isn't that where you would need it for rain? No. It's at the bottom that they leak, mostly. I wonder if the crank would have disconnected. Yep. It's buzzing. So she figured it out. Um, what we did was we tried it again with the little the little knob on the emergency window was open. And so we unplugged it and the alarm went off or it stopped, stopped buzzing. So I think we're good on that. What we're gonna do is just, we're gonna either cut these off or just run them back up into the bus here. Yeah, uh, my electrician friend comes, I might get him to help me figure it out up there, but otherwise I don't think it's a problem. It's not gonna be a problem. Melly is on the bus. Melly. John is doing the windows and Melly. Melly. <laughs> Melly. Melly girl. <laughs> Nana's girl. Melody. <laughs> Melody. <laughs> She's like, oh no, somebody's looking at me. Hey girl. <gasps> hey Melly. <gasps> Hey, that was a subtle smile. That was a subtle smile. <laughs> yes, it was. She likes her book. Do you taste it? Smells funny on here, probably. Let me see that screwdriver. That was easy enough. Yo. Caulk first. I'm gonna try. <laughs> John's cleaning with the wire brush. Got his hat on backwards and everything. <laughs> I guess I'll just caulk these holes first. Yeah. Make sure they're clean. Right, they're clean. Yeah. You just, you know, this is one of them things where you're banged if you do and banged if you don't. I know. <laughs> Wonder if you should have went another way or did it another way or something. Yeah. There goes nothing. There goes. There goes nothing. If it'll come out. Come out. <laughs> there it goes. Put a little there too. Okay. You gotta feel that hole, I think. Right? I think, I don't know. When they were sure filled when we took the windows out. They sure was. <laughs> they, were, so, they were filled with all kinds of goop. So here. Goop. Yeah. yeah. So here goes nothing then. That's right. <laughs> okay, so first time we put them in there was a crack down at the bottom so we put double butyl tape down on the bottom oh, look at the and uh, that fixed that also we got, went back and got another window so we're going to clean these windows up you know cosmetically <laughs> he's going to check to make sure it's seated well I 
I weren't tall enough to see. <laughs> so, yeah. So now Johnny is going to cut the extra and the excess butyl tape off from around the windows. Except I think he's leaving that bottom part right there, the the bottom part. And then he's gonna caulk around. Because these windows were leaking from the bottom of the window, I believe. This guy's standing in the baby seat. Can you tell the story? The what? About the baby seat. The baby seat. It goes with a little kid's table and chair set. But it's seat. the most sturdy thing we have to stand on. I say that. Pretty sturdy. <laughs> Can you hand me that razor knife? I can. Because that don't really look bad to me. Yeah, I'll cut that off. Don't look bad to me, but I'll cut it off. Yeah. Looks bad to me, but... Hmm. Right? Is it just me, or does that remind you of chicken dumplings? No, it reminds me. It reminds me of I laffy taffy. That. Laffy taffy. John's putting the last window in. We got the light bar, which I can't show you, <laughs> on the Jeep, shining in to, um, this one was different. I mean, you could show them, but it'd be like glaring. Yeah, I know. <laughs> this one was a little different. We're gonna clean the windows up more cosmetically. You're gonna have to straighten that washer out. Yeah. Okay. A little sharp right there. Okay, we thought about getting some decorative ones. Oh, look at the wreck we made. So, I'll be back in here tomorrow, cleaning all this mess up. <laughs> so, right. but we got all the windows, we got them cleaned, sealed, put back in, sealed. And now we just are waiting on the deletes to come. I ordered six deletes. Every window that has blue tape in it will get a delete. So these windows actually take that back. This window with the blue tape, I got a boo-boo, another boo-boo. That window is actually gonna be swapped with this one, so we wanna keep the emergency windows. So we're gonna put that one there, and then we're gonna put delete in that spot. So and then we're putting a delete on that side, and we're putting a delete right there. So in all, we'll have six deletes. Whoa, can't look at that. Look at all that mess. Um, yeah, so just wait on the deletes to get here. We'll install those. Johnny's out there checking the um, seal on the outside. He, what he did was he, we sealed on the inside with butyl tape and then we caulked the outside of the windows. So, yep. So guys, thanks for watching. We're gonna update when we get our deletes as far as the windows go. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here um, because we got all the windows in. Been working all day to do it. And uh, yeah, so if you're still breathing, there is still hope. And we will see you guys on the next one.